Hello, Laura. Hello, David. Good evening. Nice to see you. How are you? How was your day? As always, real tired. Tired? <laughs> yes. Tired. Okay, all right. Very good. Um, so have you done the exercises from the platform? Or no? Yes, I did. All right. Bye. So what do you do today? So what do you do at, um, you know, at work? Yeah. Well, the same every day, but I'm really tired because I work really early and I spend many time my job and try to be the things in the best way. But, you know, it's really exhausting to be out of house for many times, but it's okay. All right. I have to do my best because I, I have to do it. Where did you start learning English? Well, two years ago, I guess. But I left practice for one year. So that's why it's so difficult for me to try to speak with fluency. All right. All right. All right, that's, that's just study for eight months. Uh -huh. Yeah. And after that, I I did for myself. Well, now I'm here. Just that eight, eight months. Trying to improve more. All right. All right. Well, um, hopefully, you know, you can get something good out of this. We're actually going to practice, guys, and welcome everybody. Stephanie, how are you? Emer. Good evening. How was your day, Stephanie? I'm sorry. I noticed, I just noticed that I was mute. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Sorry for that. Well, actually, my day was pretty good. Uh, today, I had a day off. So, I, well, I take a rest um, and enjoy this day off. <laughs> but I'm good. Thank All right. you. And you? Um, I'm good. I'm good. Thanks for asking. I think it was a Let's pretty productive day. Yeah, I, I, I work a lot. <laughs> I work like, uh, I don't even count the hours, guys, because I do work a lot. Um, pretty much, uh, I'm awake since 7 a.m. Um, and then I don't rest. I still have things to do after this, you know, so it's a lot of work. Uh, but yeah, you know, it's uh, it's fun. It's fun to be busy. Um, but I need to exercise. <laughs> need to yeah, exercise. actually, it is. especially when we're uh, when we work um, like all day uh, sitting down, uh, we need to stretch. So yes. that's yes. important. Yes, yes, it is. All right. How about you, Emer? How was your day? Yeah, I like the background, man. Thank you. And my day was very busy and tired. <laughs> tiring, okay. A lot of tiring, a lot of work to do today. Okay, all right, very good. All right, uh, what about you, Carolina? How was your day? Um, hi, teacher. Well, my day was more than busy. <laughs> um, yes, I, I have to do a lot of things. I work from my house and I have a daughter three years old and nice. also a lot of things to do so it was very busy nice nice okay all right welcome aboard what about you Eric Arnoldo how was your day your microphone Eric yeah your microphone's muted thank you Thank you. Now, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Oh, can you hear me now? Yes. We okay. Can hear. Well, I was saying that my day was pretty easy. I have to run from here to there doing a lot of things. I have to, well, the last thing that I do today in the afternoon was that I went to the car, car well, let's say car shop or 
because I have to get my car back because they were fixing something with it. And in order to be ready for the class, and then I came here and tried to eat something mm -hmm. because I don't like to eat uh, later because of the time. So the head, then I have to go to the bed though. Then I didn't do the, the, re, the a, a good, uh, how do you say in this case, a good uh, movement in my stomach? You didn't do what? I'm uh, sorry. Well, that, that's it. No, I didn't know how to say it in English. So the, 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 the action that is the, the stomach do when you eat something, digestion, I don't know. Uh, digest, yes, digest. digestion. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, that's okay. That's cool. All right. Very good, guys. Okay. So anyways, all right. Let's get down to business. Okay. Sandra, welcome. Uh, nice to see you here. Claudia, nice to see you here as well. Stephanie Palacios, Palacios, nice to see you here as well. Okay. So we're going to continue, guys, with what we touched base on yesterday. All right. And we're going to practice. Okay. So I'm going to divide you into groups and we're going to talk about two things. Okay. I want you to tell me what are some differences from Salvadorians, you know, uh, what are some differences Salvadorians have compared to other nationalities? Okay. So some phrases, guys, that you can use to open the conversation would be, I think, everybody, I think. I think. I think. All right. I say that. 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 In my opinion. In my, in my opinion. opinion. All right. My take on that is. My, my take, take on, on that, that is right, that. Now, when you say take on that, guys, okay, when somebody asks you, hey, what's your take on this? That means, you know, what, what's your opinion about it? Okay, so we're talking about, mm. this is a phrasal verb for, this is an idiom for talking about, for talking about opinions, okay? All right. So the example that I gave you, uh, let me give you an example, okay? So you can say, for, uh, you can say, my take on that is that Salvadorians compared to, Americans have different tastes in food. Contrary to Americans, Salvadorians like a lot of spicy food, right? Something like that, okay? So just put into practice, just have a regular conversation, guys. One thing that I don't want you to do, because it's, it always happens, guys, I don't want sentences, okay? I don't want you to say just uh, in contrast. I don't want you to go like this, okay? So I don't want you to go like... Uh, while Salvadorians eat a lot of spicy food, Americans don't. Um, while Canadians have a great weather, we don't. Okay, I don't want you to give me sentences, okay? What I want you to do is to talk, all right? In conjunctions, talk, I mean, give your opinion in whatever you want, okay? And then the um, conjunctions, okay, will come out naturally, all right? So remember, guys, we're going to use three types of conjunctions, okay? All right, so what are they? While, like, All right, and while, and like, and in contrast to, okay? Beautiful, okay? And we use this for what? To express what? Contrast. Contrast. Very good, okay? We use this to express contrast. Good job, okay? What if we want to express exception? What do we use? Except that it's set for and it's set for the fact that. Very good, guys. Okay. How are we fluent? Every time that you're giving your opinion, we have to talk about the why, right? The what, the why, the how, when, and where. This is optional, right? But you can talk about that. For example, if, I, if I'm talking about my favorite movie, okay? Let's say that my favorite movie is uh, The Matrix, okay? You know what? My favorite movie is The Matrix. That's the what, okay? Um, the reason why is because it's a, it's an action movie and I love action movies. Its protagonist is Kenan Reeves, which is also one of my favorite characters. So I'm talking about the who, right? So who, Kenan Reeves, right? Ken of Lala, right? Um, the movie is developed, you know, within this virtual computer generated world. All right. So I'm talking about the where, right? Virtual world. All right. Um, so there was this catastrophe that happened in 1999, you know, where machines took over, et cetera, so on and so forth, okay? All right? So that's how you, um, you give your opinion with fluency, I guess, okay? 
All right, any question right now? All right, so you're going to practice two questions, guys, okay? You are going to practice this, right? So in case you forget. And I want you to talk about your favorite movies, okay? If you can, compare them, all right? All right, guys. Let's get started. By the way, are we missing anybody? Um, three... Six, seven, all right. No, I think it's all that's all of us, okay. All right, guys, let's go. So, join the rooms and practice with your couple. About the about the teacher was saying. So what are we gonna do right now? Because I so Claudia and Stephanie. Hello, Claudia. Um, we're just waiting for Stephanie. I don't know if she didn't get the the message. All right, very Did good. You, I can enter the meeting. Oh, you can enter the meeting? Hold yes, on, teacher. hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, guys. <laughs> Sorry for bringing you back. Somebody else joined in, so I am um, going to reassign you, okay? Hello there. Hello there. All right, guys, so do me a favor. Remember to have your cameras on, right? Morena, welcome back. How are you? Thank you. Um, I'm tired, but I'm, I'm fine. All right. Thank you for being here. Remember, guys, uh, to come early because we already just started practicing. Okay, but thank you for being here. All right. Um, so I'm going to divide you again, guys. Give me one second. Three, three, eight, four. All right. I think we're good. Let's go. Okay. Thanks. All right, guys, so let's start practicing, and then Hello there. Um, I'm going to be taking feedback, okay, so you can work on your areas of opportunity. Sounds like a plan? It sounds, teacher. All right, sounds like a plan, then. All right, let's go. So I'm going to start talking about my favorite movie. It is If I Stay. It is about a musician girl who plays the cello. And I'm a musician too, so that's why I liked it. I play the piano, and in fact, those are my favorite kind of movie. And I don't know if it is correct to say musical movies, but that's the one that I like. All right, you continue. I'll give you feedback after you finish, okay? But okay. Just uh, continue talking, okay? Okay, so that's about me. What about you, Emir? Okay, my favorite movie is Rush. It's about one of my big passions, F1, Formula One. It's based on kind of real events between two famous drivers like in the 70s. There, there were a great rivalry between them. And there in the movie, I chose a big accident that one of them had in, in one of the races and he almost dead. And But one of the actors is Chris Hansworth. The, the, he, may, he plays Thor in Avengers and that's movies. And it, for me, it's a great m movie based um almost real real uh, events and there is drama is formula one <laughs> and that that is my first movie okay i will watch it just because the actor <laughs> 
I love uh, nice. Thor. <laughs> so I, I will watch just because of that. And he and... appears without a t shirt. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I would like it. I love cars, you know. I like to go to um, uh, the place. Well, I have been there for three years, but I, I like to go. It was the one that is here going to Quesaltepeque. I forget the name. But where they, they run cards. And uh, I forget the name. But I like to go. El Javali. I, li I remember now. I like to go to watch those uh, kind of race. So I think I would like the movie too. Because of what is it about. What it is about. Uh -huh, yeah. So I think that's all. I we recommend the movie a lot. Really? Do you like art? Yes, I like it. Okay. All right, very good. Okay, so you're going to continue practicing art. Right. Um, I do want to have uh, a very long conversation, right? Now, uh, let me okay. give you some feedback, okay? So, pronunciation, you got to work. The pronunciation, Carolina, all right, um, of, the, of, of the instrument is not cello, it's cello. Right, that ch cello. Exactly, right. Okay. Um, you say favorite types of movie. You made this mistake twice already. All right, favorite types, or or just uh, my favorite type of movie, or my favorite type of movies. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. So how do you say it? Type of movies. Type of movies. Okay. What changes is the plural form of the noun. The noun is. Movie. Mm -hmm. Right. Excellent, teacher. Thank you. All right, then, um, Emer, after that, you said there were a great rivality. Rivality, that doesn't exist, okay? All right, first of all, there were... Rivalry. Rivalry. It's, 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 it's rivalry. Similar. Very good, okay? So rivalry. before that, okay, let's talk about yeah. there was versus there were, all right? When do we use... Remember that we're using the verb be here, all right? So what is the plural okay. form of the verb be in the past? Emer? Where? Where? Very good. Where, right? What is the singular, mm -hmm. the singular form? Was. Of the was. It is was. Okay. So if you're gonna if you're gonna talk about a great rivalry, is that singular or is that plural? It's singular. That is singular, right? Very good. So therefore, how do you say it? Okay. How do you say it? Uh, there was. There, there was a great rivalry. There was a great R rivalry. R rivalry. Rivalry. <laughs> Repeat. Rivalry. 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 Very good. All right. Rivalry. Okay. Um. Aside from that, you say in that movies. In right. that movie. In that movie, right? We, if you're gonna say movies, movie. what do you use if you're gonna say movie? Movies. Those. Those movies, right? Beautiful. All right. Then we got Carolina next. Uh, oh, by the way, you say favorite. It's not favorite. It's a V sound, v, v, v. all right? Favorite. It's a labial dental sound, right? All right, V. Repeat, favorite. 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 Very good, all right? Uh, Carolina, you said der, der, all right? Der, like Sofia Vergara, right? <laughs> right you know what happened to me, teacher? I'm watching that Mommy. series. That's why I am, I am, believe me, I am trying to to continue watching it, but stop imitating her. <laughs> and I, I'm sorry for that. No, but okay. I'm, I'm, I don't know, I like, <laughs> I like the way she, she is in the series, but I, I, I know that I don't have to copy that bad part. Yeah, she's, she's funny. She's, she's yeah. funny. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyway, so you said there, there are. There are, okay, so that. There are, are yes. And then you said go. Yes, it, all right, this is a very good cool mistake. Go. All right, you got it. Mm -hmm. you I know the teacher, but as I told you, I, I have to practice a lot. All right, then you said those kind of place. Places. Places, very good. So that's mm -hmm. good. All right, mm -hmm. continue. All right, I'll be back with you. Thank I you, teacher. You guys. Thanks to you, girls. All right, Sounds girls, really so good. let's continue practicing, and I'm going <laughs> to write it. <laughs> No. I'm gonna write down feedback, okay? So uh, right now, just just have your regular conversation, and 
I'm gonna go ahead and give you feedback after you after I stop. Okay, just continue talking right now. Okay. Okay. Right. Go ahead. Well, in okay. In contrast to China, uh, the United States produce really good products and they offer it to the whole world by the same price or a better trade. And but unlike El Salvador, we consume a lot of products that which are Chinese. Okay, I think that in contrast to Chile, has better beaches, while Salvador has much red food or something like that. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> so. Uh -huh, what well, else? I don't know. While Salvadorians enjoy several I mean, right, typical right, food. Let's, let's all right. Let's 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 restart. Okay, you're right. Um, okay. Good job, because you're trying to use the conjunctions. Remember, I don't want you to to give me sentences okay i just want you to have a regular conversation all right all right so whatever you think the differences are the differences are between El Salvador and another country i mean mm -hmm. you can talk about that if you want okay however um don't, don't give me just sentences okay go like you know what i think i don't really like the united states because um people there are not so nice you know? while in el salvador we have great people you know and the United States, all right, just whatever, right? I'm, I'm just making that, all right? So whatever whatever you want to talk about, all right, if you want to talk about, you know, uh, your favorite movie, if you like, you know, Pieter Gara's accent, all right, you can talk about that, I don't mind. I just want to hear you talk, okay, so I can hear you. Sounds good? Yeah. Let's go. Okay, well, I think that I would love to travel to to Ecuador because it has really good good places. While El Salvador has really good places too, but we spend few money just to travel um, to all places. In contrast well, to Ecuador. Okay. Well I would like to travel to United States, but I think that in contrast to Salvadorian has or are kind the United States because I think that they are some rude. Well, we are kind, I don't know. Well, it could be, but you know that we have really different cultures, so while we are just helping other people, maybe helping to cross the the street. The street. Yeah, they are offering help to all the immigrants that travel from Central America to pass through Mexico until they get to the United yeah. States. All right, good job. Applause for you, girl. All right. Anyways, um, let me share your small feedback right now. Then I'll be back with you. <laughs> Don't worry, you, you guys did good, okay? All right, so that's uh, Sandra and Dan Lores, okay? So let me let me um, let me give you your feedback so you can start right now practicing, you know, practicing improving those specific things, okay? So one of the first things that we're gonna work on, all right? Let's, let me start with Sandra, okay? You said you said the United States, probably you said the United States, right? But that's okay, I didn't write it down, right? Uh, the United States produce, okay? Uh, when we say produce, Producers. very good, because we're talking in third, third person. Person, right? All right. Mm -hmm. So you know, if you know that's you just need to just need to focus. Yeah. Okay? You said yeah. think, and this is a common mistake from Spanish speakers. Have you ever heard Sofia Regatta talking? <laughs> I think, I think, I think. Yeah. Right. right? <laughs> All right. How are you gonna do that, right? That, like something like that. I don't know, right? So that's because, okay, in Spanish we only have five vowel sounds. Okay, in Spanish you're taught that you have I O. Yes. 
That's yes. it, right? In English, all right? How many how many uh, vowel sounds? And I'm talking about vowel sounds. You think that we have in English? At least four for each Spanish vowel. Okay, all right, very good. We have fourteen. Yeah. All right, we have fourteen, and we have twenty-four consonant sounds. Okay. So check that out. We have 14, not five. We have 14, right? So there is a difference between this sound, okay? Check this out, all right? When you say, for example, this versus these, all right? Yeah. Pronounce these, girls. This. This. All right, how do you pronounce it, Laura? This. This, okay, very good. It's a it, it, it. All right? Repeat, it. 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 It, all right, it's a, it's still it, a D, right? It, 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 all right, it's just it, 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 all right. But the other sound is e, e versus e, 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 all right. So when you pronounce when you pronounce think, all right, you're using the short think. i, okay? think, not think, think, think. think. Right? Very good. Uh, then you said in contrast to, uh, oh, no, I'm sorry, that's Laura's. Uh, they say few money, okay? Few money. Lara. You have to you have to study this, okay? Countable versus uncountable nouns, okay? So that's the topic, okay? So when we use we use few when we're talking about countable nouns. Now, can you count money? This is a tricky question. Can you count money? Yes. Yes. Or no? yes. No, you cannot. All right. <laughs> My money, yes, yeah, because it's a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> no, okay, all right, hold on. Okay, it's uncountable. No, guys, all but right. not mine. All right, no. Um, you cannot. Hold on, I'm trying to change my background. All right, very good. So you cannot. Okay, you cannot count money. And I'm not talking about money like the, the physical money. I'm talking about the noun. Money is a noun, guys, okay? All right? The word, the word money, you cannot count it, okay? All right, si yo te digo, ¿puedes contar la palabra dinero? No, no puedes contar la palabra dinero, no. right? All right, very good. So I have, you can say I have a lot of money, or you can say, you know, I don't have much money, okay? Or I just have very little money, all right? So that's how you would say it. Um, then you said, um, then you said uh, cultures or cultures, I don't know. It's cultures, repeat, everybody, cultures. Cultures. All right, or, you know, culture in general, right? This is called a schwa sound, okay, a schwa vowel, all yeah. right? So, uh, but good job, all right? Then we got Laura, all right, Laura, same thing. You said think, think, right? It's okay. You said in contrast to Chile, have more beach. All right, uh, this, this, all right. In contrast to Chile, or to Chile, right? We have more beaches, all right? So that's how we say it, okay? I'm gonna type it in here. In contrast to Chile, we have more beaches, okay? So that's how you would say it. Uh, you said to United to United States, okay? So you said that you'd like to live or to travel there. Now, let me, all right, there, do you know what articles are? Articles are these guys, okay? Articles are a uh, and, and the, okay? Or, or the, depending on. All right, anyways, so those are the articles, okay? With countries, guys, okay, when you have countries, for example, the Netherlands, uh, the United States, all right, these two countries, guys, are they plural or not? No, they yes. are singular. No, it's plural. Yes. Yeah. It is plural. Yes. All right. When you there have... Are many states. Exactly. So you say, mm -hmm. I want to travel to the, right, and then you say to the United States, okay? I want to travel 
to the to the Netherlands, okay? So after a, a vowel, I have to say that. And after a consonant, can I use the? The Netherlands, okay? It is, it is uh, the, uh, the United States and the Netherlands, okay? All right, the pronunciation changes. If it is a vowel, you say the United States, right? If it is a consonant, it is the Netherlands, right? But what about these guys? If you say Canada, is it, I want to travel to the Canada or to Canada? To Canada. Very good. I want to travel to Canada, okay? All right. And that's it, okay? So plural, plural nouns uh, for countries, you use the article. All right, singular, you do not use any article, all right? All right, continue practicing. I'm going to check on the other groups. You guys are doing a good job. Okay. All right, let's Thank try you. to improve on this, um, you know, from this feedback, okay? All right. All the time. All right, girls. Um, so my favorite guys, uh, turn on the cameras. I will listen to you right now, and I will give you feedback, okay? So whatever you're talking about, just talk, you know, a regular conversation. And I'm going to uh, write down feedback and help you in your areas of opportunity. Good? Yes. Uh, actually, I didn't start at the beginning of the class because I, I arrived too late at home. Oh, okay. Don't worry about that. Okay. Yes. And I didn't under... I, I, I actually didn't understand the, the topic uh, okay. of the class. All right, don't worry. But I try. Don't worry. So what we're doing right now, let me help you with that, okay? What we're doing right now is that I want you to answer these questions, okay? What are some differences of Odorians have compared to other nationalities, okay? And the other question is, I don't want you to talk about your favorite movie, all right? While you're giving your opinion... You might use, you know, conjunctions for exception and conjunctions for contrast, okay? But I do not want sentences. I just want you to give me your opinion, right? You know, I, I think, you know, Salvadorians are, uh, a, you know, Salvadorians are great. The reason why is because we, if, uh, if we face a problem, you know, we always know how to come up with a great solution about it. We're very creative when it comes down to solving issues, you know? All right, so just give me any opinion that you have, all right? And while you do that, girls, I will be giving, uh, I will be taking feedback, all right? Writing down feedback, and I will give it to you, okay? So just talk, all right? And don't worry, Marina. Uh, every time, okay. anytime that you're going to come late, just do me a favor. Just send me a message mm -hmm. on WhatsApp so I can know, okay? All right. Okay. All right, very good. Don't worry, all right? Mm -hmm. So let me hear you. Send me a um. Mm -hmm. So, so what are some differences of the Orient's have compared to other nationalities? Teacher, what is that? Uh, what? It said el anfitrión le ha pedido que inicie su video. What is oh, that? okay, no, yeah, I, I, I sent that. Because oh, you need to have the okay. camera turned on. All right, but go ahead. Okay. So let's get started, right? So what's your opinion on that? Um. In that case, we are using the the contrast and exceptions too. Uh, prefer preferably. Um, but not necessary. Preferably, right? But no, uh, not necessary. Okay, I, do, I just want you to give me your opinion. Have a regular conversation, okay? And I, okay. What I think the Salvadorians are mm -hmm. have compared with another with. Compared to other nationalities, um, I think for for food, for yeah, uh, just continue. Maybe. Uh, 
Uh, I think pupusas, Salvadorian, pup, Salvadorians, pup, Salvadorian pupusas are compared to baleadas from Honduras. Oh, nice. And which ones do you think are better? Mm, yes, some people are, are fighting about what is the best. Okay, and what, what's your take on it? What is your opinion about it? In my opinion, the pupusas are better. Okay, well, how do you say that in English? <laughs> no, no Spanish. Okay. Uh -huh. So which one is better in, in your opinion? In my opinion, the much better are pupusas. Okay, why? Because someday, actually, I I taste a uh, baleada and I don't like it. Really don't like it because I think it's it's really basic uh, mix. The texture is not so good, and it is only a a mix of beans and i don't remember another the other ingredient ingredients it, there are difference for me the best is the best option are pupusas okay right so in general you think pupusas are better okay all right very good i'm gonna go ahead and give you your feedback right now and then you start practicing with somebody else correcting this feedback okay Overall, very good job, but uh, so let's go ahead and take a look at the chat. All right, first off, okay, we have think, okay, I think, right? It's not I think. The In, in English, okay, we have short vowel sounds and we have long vowel sounds, okay? All right, so there are two vowels here, okay? E and E, E and E. Let's pronounce it, E. E. And E. E. All right. Think. Okay. I think. I think. Very good. Okay. No, very good. Okay. You got it. All right. Okay. Uh, then you say, I think for food because some, right. I have no idea what that means. Okay. Uh, I think for food. Yo pienso por comida. All right. Uh, oh, it's okay. I, I think, I, I think you wanted to say this. I think. It's because of, okay, so that preposition right there, because of food, okay, because okay. of the food, okay, all right. Then you Thanks. said, um, because someday I taste, okay, now 80% of what we talk is in, is, in, is in the past. Did you know that? 80%, right? So um, if, you're to if you're telling a story, you know, you need to tell it to tell it in the past okay there is a way to say it in the present but but in your case you know for practicing purposes just say it in the past okay all right so how would i say you know because one day not someday right because one day i what is the simple past of taste tasted tasted very good okay all right, very good. Okay, so simple past. You said it's really basic mix. The texture, the texture is not the texture. So texture. Texture. Very good. Texture. Okay, very good. Okay. Um, okay. So you forgot. It's really basic mix. Okay. You're missing the article here. Okay. It's a really basic mix. The article is a. All right. Okay. Then you said. Um, in, uh, the pronunciation is ingredients. Repeat, ingredients. Ingredients. All right, very good. Ingredients. Okay, good job. Other than that, it was good. I could understand what you were saying, all right? But um, uh, just, you know, just practice a little bit more, right? So continue. I'm going to check on the last group, and then we're going to head back to the main room, okay? It's okay. All right. Or the movie, Hello. the chapter yes. TV series. I'm Hello, gonna, I'm gonna teacher. Get to with someone else, uh, Morena. <laughs> hi, teacher. <laughs> hi, right. Stephanie, and hi, Eric. Right. Hello, Morena. Hello, Morena. I think she's not here anymore. Yeah, yeah, I sent it. I sent her to um, 
I sent her into a different room. All right, so uh, continue talking, guys. I didn't I, know that Morena was here. Uh, she just came and she just left. All right. So I'm uh, just. Uh, t I need you to practice right now, guys. Okay, I'm gonna listen to you and I'm gonna give you feedback. Okay, on what your areas of opportunity okay. are. All right. Very good. All right. So let's go. Okay, sir. Okay, so um, let's continue. Yeah, I was. Uh, let me see. It. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead. I was talking about the, the the movie, about the scenes or the the what was was the the part of the movie that we that you enjoy the most, for a scene or maybe a a, a a one what or what chapter, do you enjoy the most? Oh, which which one of them oh, do you like okay, the most? It. For uh, for example, but, in my case, uh, I don't know why, but I enjoy the scenes where, uh, for example, was Aiden? What was the name of the guy? Uh, Jonas? Do you remember Jonas when Jonas and Martha Jonas. when Jonas and Martha were each other I enjoyed those kind of things no matter what they were doing just I enjoyed the things where they were sharing uh, talking or walking or doing something oh mm. for example yeah, I enjoy case, one thing yeah when they were seated on the on the shore of a, a lake, and Jonas came from the future, and she and she said something to Martha, and the other Jonas was uh, just a little bit ahead of Martha, and but the the the, the oldest Jonas in that case came. Uh, he was uh, with a uh, a mark here in in his neck because. He was being cut up in a tree because some, someone else was trying to kill kill him in the future and then came back to the past and he was carrying carrying with him a, a cross with San Cristobal cross or or a coin I don't, I don't remember well what uh, I, I enjoyed that kind of uh, I really 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 good job Erica I, I like that you talk a lot I'm gonna give you feedback in a minute all right I, I just want to hear Stephanie okay all right, let's go, Stephanie. What's uh, okay, teacher? Okay, uh, well, according to according to the TV series, Eric, um, I don't have favorite parts, but I have to say that my um, one part that I liked the most was when Noah was on the church. I don't know uh, in the dark TV series the Part that I liked the most was the was the um, landscapes or the or the places yeah. where where the where the TV series was mm -hmm. was filmed uh, the church the lake yeah. um, I don't know the 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 houses there like the suburbs uh, I I like that I like uh, I like that um, that part and. Also, the um, I don't know the I don't know how to say that um, the where uh, where they were working on the uh, I don't remember that but the, like the Chernobyl uh, the Chernobyl Tower I don't know how to oh, say the, that the, 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 yes. The, well, even in Spanish, I don't remember that, that name. <laughs> a nuclear plant. Yes, you're right, the nuclear plant. Yeah. And I don't know, that, that's why the, I like the most about the, the dark TV series. But for example, in the Stranger Things, like we're, we, are, we were talking about, we, um, I like the, the creatures that appear there. I don't know, it's like uh, <laughs> you're, yeah. as you said, as you mentioned before, uh, you need to sit down and don't stand up, even if you are thirsty or you want to go to the bathroom. You need to finish the chapter <laughs> to dunk it, yes. and because you don't, if you don't want to to lose yourself, right? So I don't know. I like that kind yeah. of TV series and movies, like science fiction or drama. They are cool. <laughs> yeah, they're good, really good. All right, very good. Okay, good job. All right, uh, good examples. Okay, great, 
great fluency. Eric, okay, let's start with you, okay? Uh, you're very fluent, man. You, you, you seem to have experience speaking in English. Very good job. All right, you say, for example, for example, uh, short, uh, well, no, not short, I'm sorry, uh, you say, uh, yeah, you say, you say short, all right, short, all right. So yeah. R sounds, okay, all right, the R in English is not the same as Spanish, okay? So if you ever got to say short, yeah. right, very good, right? But we don't want to speak less <laughs> if you ever got it, right? Uh, really, really good fluency, though, all right? It was really good fluency. You have a great fluency and, um, and uh, good vocabulary, too. You're even using phrasal verbs, which is actually something that Spanish speakers, you know, where we Spanish speakers are not used to using so much. Um, then you said uh, things, things instead of things, okay? So there is a difference between, you, you should study this, okay? Short vowel sounds versus long vowel sounds, okay? We have 14 different types of vowel sounds in, in English, okay? So there is a difference between these two sounds. Repeat. Okay. E and E. E, 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 E. Repeat. Uh, e. 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 All right. All right, Stephanie, e. let's go. E. e. All right, so E. 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 Very good. E. All right. E. Thanks. Repeat, thanks. Thanks. All right. Thanks. Very good. Thanks. And you have to pronounce the, the, the G consonant, right? Uh, that's it, man. Then you say Jonas, Jonas, right? It's John, uh, Jonas, okay? Jonas. 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 That's just sound, okay? Jonas. Yeah, beautiful job, man. Beautiful job, okay? Jonas. These are like Jonas. very minor mistakes. Okay? You're certainly, you certainly are an advanced student, okay? Good job. Now, Stephanie, all right? Stephanie, uh, nice. you're saying favorite or favorite, actually, favorite. You say favorite, my favorite movie, right? That's very Spanish, okay? The, the right pronunciation, all right? That V sound, it's a labial dental sound, right? Favorite. Repeat the favorite. 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 Very good. That's the right pronunciation, right? You said parts instead of parts. Repeat parts. 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 Okay. TV series, parts. right? Now, TV series doesn't exist, okay? It's TV series. Series is the singular form. It's not plural, right? No es plural. Okay. It's a singular. It. Series is singular, right? You said uh, film, the film, they filmed Siri. it, filmed it. Repeat, filmed it. Filmed it. Filmed it. Filmed. Filmed. The, 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 at the, at the end. If it is in the past, filmed. they filmed it. Oh, okay. Filmed it. Very good. Filmed it. All right. Uh, got it. So pretty much the endings, you know. That part, you say that part, that part. All right. So that part. Right. Say it with me that part. Part. That part. That part. Okay. And then you say you need to finish to don't get. You need to finish it so you don't get. So you don't, right? You said to don't, right? You need to finish watching it so you don't get. Uh, you don't get lost, okay? You say so you don't lose yourself. No, so you don't get lost, okay? All right. So that's just vocabulary there. All right. But overall, very good job, guys, okay? Really, really good. We're gonna head back to the main room now, guys, right? Good job. Hello there. Oh, I, I was muted. All right, guys, good job. Hello, okay. I, think, I think I ended up giving feedback to everyone, didn't I? Yes, right? Yes. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh, we're missing Claudia. Is there somebody else missing aside from Claudia? No, right? Were we? No, we were eight guys. We're missing two people. Oh, Stephanie's here. Okay, there you go. All right, Stephanie's here. All right, very good, guys. So, anyways, how do you like? How do you like? How do you feel after the feedback? I feel great because I took note of all my feedback. Okay. All right. So see you guys, those are, you know, the type of things that we need to, um, to work on, okay? 
All right, feedback is always constructive, guys. Okay, so don't get mad. <laughs> it's just for you know, so so you can, so we can help you. Okay. All right. So, so now, guys. Okay. Uh, before we go, okay. Uh, who has finished this part, guys? I finished. Have you all finished it? I finished it. You but finished it. I have a problem at the at the end. <laughs> All right, that's okay, right? We're gonna solve it together right now, okay? So let's go with Laura, all right? Let's, uh, Laura, what's the answer for number one? Laura, five, four, three, two, one. You don't see. Number two, five, four, three, two, one. Come on, man. The first one. All right. Very good. Okay. Um, Morena, number three. Okay. Number three is letter B. People here don't usually have more than one TV. Very good. Okay. All right. Part two. Okay. All right. So type the conjunction that is being used in each sentence. Use capital letter. Now period is needed. Okay. So there is no need for a period. All right, so what is the first conjunction that we use here, uh, Eric Arnoldo? Uh, let's see. I haven't finished that part yet, but uh, can somebody help me? Can somebody can help me a hand? Well, uh, you should have this in your notebook. There are... It's unlike, I think. Unlike, okay, very good, okay. It's right, unlike. All right, number two. Um, Carolina. Can you scroll down, teacher, please? <laughs> so I can see. Yes, I so, yes, While. Can. While, okay, while. Remember, guys, you have to use capital letter at the beginning, right? Sandra, number three, Sandra. Okay, teacher. In contrast. In contrast, okay. All right, so let's see if these are correct. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right, very good. It says type the conjunction that is used in, in each sentence, right? So, guys, the first one, the first one that is used, what is it? This while. is the first sentence, guys. While. Okay. While. While, right? Secondly, what is it? <laughs> Unlike. Unlike, okay. <laughs> what was that laugh? <laughs> like. All right, the thing is that we confuse them. I, I while and unlike all right very good guys okay. okay good job all right really really good again all right guys so this is uh we're just gonna see you guys some um, you know some vocabulary right now all right so do my favorite just take notes okay all right and please let me know if you're able to listen to the video your answers with your class are we able to listen to the video yes, yes. I listen. all right sounds good yes are you typical? I have never shopped online. I eat breakfast every morning. I have a full or part-time job. I have visited a foreign country. I use public transportation. I keep a daily personal diary. Now guys, why why is she asking if you're typical? What what are these things? What do you think? It's like the common things that we we do every day, or like a daily routine. If are the same or different to another people. Very good. Okay. Good job. Plus for Laura, guys. Good job, Laura. Good job, guys. So, yes, guys. It's basically what we do every day, right? So that's something typical. What if you're doing like the same, you know, the same thing everybody else does, then you are a typical person, right? So. Uh, so what do you think about number one? If I said, repeat guys, repeat after me. I have never shopped online. I have never, I have never, never shopped, shopped online. I have never shopped online. No, okay. I have never shopped online. Very good. Shopped guys, not shop, shopped. All right. Shop. The final, shop. the e shop. Shop. sound is shopped, okay? So is this typical guys? I have never shopped online. Is this a typical person? Mm. Nowadays, yeah. 
No. No, a what? No. Oh, everybody, everybody, you know, shops online. So, I don't. <laughs> what about Hugo? Uh, Hugo In the marketplace. Uh, Uber Eats. Um, <laughs> you, can even, you can even order food from selectors, you know? So in the marketplace, there you go, yes. Very good, all right? So is this typical or not? What do you think? No. All right, not a typical person, right? No. So, all right, number two, guys. If I say I eat breakfast every morning, is that a typical I, person? Yes. 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 All, right. all right, very good, all right. Number three, what about that? Uh, is that a typical person? I have a full or part-time job. Simple. All right. Yes or no, guys? It is typical or not? Yes, typical. It is yes, typical. Teacher. It is a typical person, right? I have visited a foreign person. Foreign. Not typical. Not typical. No, no, repeat, guys. Foreign. 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 All right. That's how you read this. Okay? I have visited a foreign um. country. I have visited a foreign country. I have visited a foreign country. Right. Do you think that this is a typical person? No. No, no, no typical. No. Not, not really. Not, maybe not. Uh, what about if, if you use public transportation? Does that make you a typical person? Yes. Yeah. All right. Yes. Oh, what about keeping a daily personal diary? Not anymore, <laughs> not anymore, not right? Typical. Yeah, like I no, think. those are those are 14. <laughs> yes, yes, I had a. Um, I'm gonna mute some of you guys because of the background noise, okay? Uh, but it's not that I want good to teacher. All right, very good. So, um, so, anyways, guys, yes, we don't we don't do that anymore, guys. Okay, we people, I, I haven't seen that's like for teenagers, you're right. You know, I had a yes, I, for teens. I used to have an uh, a girlfriend like uh, when I was like sixteen, and, and she used to have some, you know, a diary. Ooh. And she would uh, she would make me write down things in her diary. You know, now that I think about it, that's 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 very silly. <laughs> All right, but uh, <laughs> <laughs> but in the past, it wasn't for you because you were in love. You know what? It was still silly, but I did it because I liked her a lot. <laughs> <laughs> anyways, I see. Guys. All right, very good. All right, so anyways, um, that's it, guys. That's it for today. Tomorrow, <laughs> we're going to have the last day. Um, well, it's, it's going to be the end of the week. Okay? So we're not, we're not going to have any class on <laughs> Friday. Okay? What do you mean? Yeah. Oh, you should be stuck. All right. All right, but do me a favor, guys. No, I'm not. I'm not. Uh, you're not? <laughs> All right. Uh, do my favorite, guys. I'm not. <laughs> I'm sorry for interrupting. Uh, please finish, guys, as much as you can from the platform, the section one. Okay? All right. So make sure, guys, okay, teacher. make sure that this section is completed at 100%. Okay. Other than that, guys, okay. Uh, okay thank you very much for joining. Uh, thank you, Laura, Amen, Sandra, Eric, Marina, Carolina, Stephanie, for joining. You have a great night. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Same for Bye. you guys. Take care.